consistent during a busy eight days, Albuquerque will be home to a concentration of mini festivals and events featuring and representing some of our city's best art, technology, even culture. It's called Umbrella Week and it's all kicking off this weekend here with details on Umbrella Week. And one of those events you can check out this Sunday, Carlos Contreras with Tractor Brewery and I'm a Star Productions and Skelly Greer with Skill Skells. Skell's art. Got it right. <laughs> Thank you guys for joining yeah, us this right morning. On. Thanks for having us. So I'm pretty pumped about this. Tell me about this umbrella week. It's really like what a week and a half almost. It's yeah, it's it's a little over a week, which is how Albuquerque tends to do things. When you say a week, then we go like way too far, yeah. which is cool. <laughs> um, but it's art, tech and culture for eight days. And so you have art events, tech events, culture events, like it sounds. Um, and a lot of them are free. Not everything's free, but a lot of them are free. Okay. Uh, many of them are, if not all of them, are family friendly. So, and they're all over the city, right? Like downtown, uh, Knob Hill, just different pockets. Okay, to, to so maybe if you can't make it to one event, you can make it to another. Exactly, you should plan a whole week. You can have a, a variation of things to do. So. What do you hope, because it's the first year, right? It is, it What is. do you hope people are gonna take away from this? Ideally, people take the desire away to have it happen again next year. You know, it mm -hmm. should be an annual event in theory. So, um, but yeah, take away like the art, soak it up, uh, check out local businesses, local artists. Um, support each other because Albuquerque needs that. And you're going to have one of the events at Tractor Brewery? We are. It's called I'll Drink to That. Okay. Um, Tractor Brewing Wells Park, which is 1800 4th Street, uh, September 13th from 4 to 7. It's free. Uh, it's I'll Drink to That. It's live artists, poets, musicians, comedians, okay. uh, a variety show. And one of our live artists is right here. Right here. Yeah. You're going to be painting live? Yes, ma'am. Wow. How um, fascinating is that? It's a lot of fun. I do a lot of live events. Uh -huh. I've I can't even count how many I've done this year, but definitely thanks to Carlos for getting me into the I'll Drink to That's last year. I continue to do them this year, and I just love painting live in front of people. And I love seeing you know, your paint, your, your, you. your artwork here. Um, wow, tell me the inspiration for these pieces here. Um, I'm a big zombie fanatic, um, definitely a big zombie fanatic. Um, I was raised on like Mad Magazine okay. and a lot of other you know weird type comic books, so uh -huh. I definitely have a more comic style and I just really like stickers as you see on the painting for Better Call Saul here. And then there's really no inspiration behind them. I just kind of look at a photo online and I kind of try and make my own version of it. Just kind of do what you do, yeah. right? What do you hope people take away from this when they see you painting live? Um, I hope that it'll inspire them to, you know, pick up the pencil that they put down or, you know, start painting again or even just, you know, getting their family out to these events because it's definitely a family oriented environment. Mm -hmm. I've actually done one of the I'll Drink to That's with my little brother before and he's uh, he just turned 12. Okay. So we both got to auction off one of our pieces and you know it's it's something he looks up to and he can tell his friends he got to participate in. Do you ever have people so, that are watching you walk up to you and say how did you get involved in this? How can I get involved in this? Yeah definitely so definitely so and usually if uh, Carlos is around I'll refer them to Carlos or you know, definitely just make sure to pass them in the right direction so they can definitely get involved. Absolutely. And inspire so. others, right? Always, always. So, Carlos, I'm a Star Productions. You're a part of that, right? Yes, ma'am. What uh, is that? It's, it started out as an idea, and it's now what I call my own business. Um, it's, it's basically a, a company that puts together events all over the city. So, um, if you need the services of a person like me that knows a lot of artists and a lot of different genres, uh, to put put a party together. Uh, it's pretty much what I do. Okay, yeah. and you guys are sponsoring this, or I guess hosting it? Yeah, um, Tractor Brewing is the venue, and I'm a Star Productions is always like the organizing body of okay. all drink to that. Okay. 41 months old, so 41 shows, 41 months. Now I know Tractor Brewing, you guys do a lot with the art community. Why is that? There's there's artists on staff. I think it just kind of like, it, it came from behind the bar, and now it's on the other side. Like uh, Lauren Poole, who's part of the 13th, the, the event on 13th, okay. and part of TEDx, is a bartender at Tractor Brewing. Wow. Uh, Carlos the Tall, who plays for Youngsville, is a bartender. So we have musicians, poets, comedians, all on staff. So mm -hmm. why not just involve your staff even more in your operation? I love that. So when is the event taking place at Tractor Brewing? The 13th from 4 to 7. 4 to it's 7. It's a Sunday, so don't do laundry. Come drink beer. <laughs> there you go. Do you have to buy tickets in advance, or how does that work? It's completely free. So, okay. Uh, and you so can bring your kids if you're, you know, kids with a parent or guardian, and you can even bring your dogs. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Um, for the other events, where can they go to get details on that? Umbrellaweek.org. So just check it out. I mean, it's a whole list of events. Uh, hashtag Umbrella Week. So on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. Um, you'll just see it popping up. Share it, join it. Please, okay. like, get involved. It's a, it's a Albuquerque-centric thing where it's like, pass it along. Yeah. Uh, we really want the city to be like, we need to have this every year. I right? love it. But we need the city support. So Absolutely. Join. So go support. Thank yeah. you guys for joining us this Thank morning. You. For more details, go to our website, krq.com. We'll have a recap of this interview along with links there. We'll be right back.